Hi, I'm Christine from The Locker Planner and welcome to another delicious keto recipe. Today, I create some delicious almond crunches. Super delicious and super easy to make. So, step number one, we need to melt here some chocolate. So, first step first, we're gonna put some water in a pot and just gonna melt it. And gonna heat it up. So next step is before while the water is boiling or just heating up, we gonna roast the delicious almonds. I go you can cut them into smaller chunks, but I just go here with the whole nut and we're gonna roast it for 160 degrees for around about 10 to 15 minutes. Depends on how crunchy you want your almonds. I go here more super crunchier. So, while the water just gets hot, I just gonna put a bowl on top and just gonna add some chocolate. So I go here with one, one bar, just 100 grams. I put the ingredients in the description box below that you can cook the recipe too. Okay, that looks pretty great. So next step is a fun part. I go here with dried blueberries and cranberries. I dried them with my dehydrator and just add only the rest. It's just like, you see, almost one tablespoon. This gives your almond crunch a super fruity delight. And to this, we're gonna add unsweetened cocoa, sh cocoa shreds. We're gonna add unsweetened cocoa shreds and then we're gonna stir everything very well up. So, and the last step is we're gonna add the almonds to it. Stir everything very well and then comes the last step. Okay, I'm going here with a parchment paper and then I'm gonna place with a tablespoon smaller bites or like pralines, however you wanna call it. And that's simply it, my friends. So at the moment we have uh, minus one degrees outside in Germany so I can cool it outside <laughs> but you can put it also in the freezer or in the fridge just let it cool down for at least 10 to 15 minutes and then you can simply enjoy it my friend I hope you enjoyed this video please let me know in the comment section below what I can turn for you next time into vegan keto see you next time same time same place thank you for watching